I will say, beautiful animation. Like, I loved watching it with my eyeballs. Mm -hmm. I like the music, but to me, I didn't live the hype. It just didn't. And that's just me. I know, Josh, we, him and I had this conversation. I like the songs, like the animation. I liked one subplot. Mm -hmm. The rest... It was mm -hmm. fine. It was a good. It's a cute movie for kids. So I think it was a cute movie for kids. Yeah, I mean, going in after your review, you definitely undersold it. So then me, I having heard about the hype and then hearing your mixed review, I was like, okay, I guess it's gonna be just okay. And I was totally blown away by it. I loved Encanto. I loved the I songs. Don't get it. I loved the story. I thought then, about, where was the story, Josh? Me. Where well, was it? In the songs. The what? songs themselves no. were like okay, as part I of the story. love musicals. Y'all know this. Mm. The songs the, the songs in a musical should always add to the story, not be the story. Unless it's like Lamus or he Hamilton. Wears all songs. Right? But they're not. They're not all songs. Mm. Why? You don't know the struggles of and spoiler alert for Encanto of the sisters of the the main girl of any of them unless it's through song which is fine if it's a musical take away the songs there's no story mm -hmm. that's my problem mm. you see other within disney uh the little mermaid beauty and the beast uh mulan you take the songs out there's still a story there mm -hmm. and that was my problem with encanto like i feel like people like like i said especially because this entire time i've been like really dissecting story and there isn't one. There is one, but they told the wrong one. Mm. Like the story with the grandma and like the reason she's the way she is. Like that's a beautiful story. Like even the song about her struggles was that's a beautiful, song. beautiful song. And it made sense in the narrative to those, add it those on origitas, there. Those origitas, I think. Yeah. yeah. It made sense to have it in the narrative because you're kind of like, who is this lady? Those what? Origitas? Orig Origitas. Origitas. Like, like what the is that? little two caterpillars the, yeah caterpillars oh it's okay. the name of the song it's a beautiful song where and they play that song and they show the grandma's story and they say the grandma's story mm -hmm. i would have loved to see that and that i feel like i have a roma it's moment. okay yeah we're gonna get a we're gonna get a grandma prequel in like 30 years and Pro it's not sound. even <laughs> talk about like a year and a half yeah. it's, like at this point we're getting a next year it's already uh -huh. been the works like and that to me that's kind of what bothered me as someone who likes musicals as someone who likes stories as someone who appreciates good disney animated films like the ones we've had in the past one that we've discussed here in the podcast i just it was good. It was fun. I like the songs. I listen to the songs now because they're fun. But, like, there's no story there. It feels shallow. Mm. And that's what I don't like it. 